All right, hello there. I am Papa One, and this is King of the Coliseum Two, and it's time to start the round of 16 first half for the 32 man freestyle PW tournament. So you already know we're using slot number nine to continue this. So let's get started. The first match is going to be 27 versus 69. So without further ado, we can get started going to the game. Once again, how's everyone doing? We're going to do this, the first four matches on this video, then the next four matches on the next video, basically. Then we may go back to, oh yeah, because now I'm on, um, what is it? Show 10B for the AOS versus Peresta 2. Okay, yeah. <laughs> Who did I say was 27 versus 'll show you that then we're just gonna skim through it because I don't really have to talk about the match stuff so let's go on here pw so the main thing to know right here what you're looking at is that you know it's not infinite rounds it's actually two rounds other than that rope break is turned on and Lumberjack is turned off so they can get out the ring if it's a 20 second um, count out or whatever like that. The ramp is on here so the ramp is connected and that's pretty much everything, you know, that you've seen from the last videos with this. I'm just going to skip down here and stuff like that. When by KO, 10 count, pinfall, submission, and critical. And you ain't gonna have to listen to me talk about the rules again in this video or the second half. I only do it per round. Yeah. All right, let's get started with the match. And you already know I skipped the entrances and stuff like that. I just feel like it takes too long to get done with. You know? I know a lot of people do YouTube videos, always have the entrances and stuff. I just skip through it because I'm recording, you know. I care less. Scoop slam. Some clinch knees. Yo, I, that's the, um, what's this? The the um, black mass or whatever like that. Alistair Black, or as he's called now, Malachi. Before that, he was Tony Me. Camo Clutch. I mean, wait. yeah, it's called Camo Clutch. It's choking him now. I just whip it to the corner. Rolling kick. Kick to the body. Drop Toho. Let drop miss. Critical suplex. Oh, 
That was a knee to the head on the ground. Power slam. Falling power slam. Tim Tone. Nora Lights released suplex. Back body drop. Another falling power slam. Sharp shooter. Toss him to the outside. Hits the ropes. Oh, the basement. The basement. Um, basement drop kick miss. That time it lands. It goes for it again, but. I don't know why. I thought he was going to go for a different type of dive out the ring because he hit the ropes. I guess that's the safer dive to go for. Tree of Woe. Drop kick. Running drop kick in the corner. Ten minutes has passed in the first round. Hip toss. Drag him to the middle. Off the crab. Rope break. Arm wrench into an arm breaker. Follow the back suplex. Snap there. Kick to the back of the knee. Two count. Snap power bomb. Got the knockdown for the two count. Elbow to the back. Some more choking. Two minutes left in this first round. Snap there. Shoulder block. Kick to the door. Somersault leg drop. Oh, that was the. Uh, 2.99 Yeah, the round was going to end before the 10 count could happen. Yeah. Right now, two coasts Scorpio, or, or as it says or here, number 69, he's going to pray. He's in the lead, I should say, because you know who's going to win. Running for him, smash. Or jumping for him, spins. That's enough for him. Oh, uh, that kick got blocked. And he rolled out of the way of that flying attack. I think that was the center. Summer shot leg drop. And that got the win. I think that what that was. It wasn't a somersault centaur. It looked like more like a leg drop because he landed with his body flattened out. So that would be a somersault. I did that shit wrong. There we go. Thirty-five versus seventy-eight. All right. Yeah, thirty-five. 
Empire versus the <laughs> Yeah, because if the match goes the distance, they go to have a time decision or a judgment, whatever you want to call it. Roundhouse kicks to the body. Some clenched knees to the body. Snap mare. Kick to the spine. Forearm to the back. Elbow to the back. Irish whip. Some clenched knees. Leg submission after... The arm drag, close to the back of the neck, elbow to the back, scoop slam, stomp, dragon screw, run the forearm smash, got a four count off of it, rolling leg submission. Sleeper hole. Vertical suplex. Irish whip into the corner. Tree of woe. Kick to the body. Knee drop. Drop toe hole. Rolling leg submission. Arm breaker. Stunner. Iris right, whipping to the corner. Running back elbow. Rear naked choke was in the ropes. Counter arm drag. Leg submission. Another counter leg submission. Rolling leg submission. He just attacking his legs this whole match. Another counter leg submission. Rope break that time. Counter Insiguri. Pick him up. Counter snap suplex. They're both down. Got Toho. Two count. STO picks him up. Double underhook suplex. Dang. I'm just standing in the corner and just got hit. It's all days. Drop kick to the back of the head. Well, I should say diving drop kick to or flying drop kick to the back of the head. No, missile drop kick to the back of the head. My bad. Submission on the ground. Irish whip into the corner. Some clenched knees in the corner to the body. That dragon screw got a knockdown. I believe that was a T-bone suplex right there. Rolling legs to make sure he's in the rope. Flying guillotine choke. STO 
STO finisher. Submission in the middle of the ring. Oh, freaking round ended. They circling each other. Spinning elbow. Or rolling elbow, I should say. Flying kick. Counter leg submission. Flying guillotine. Irish open to corner. Rolling wheel kick in the quarter. That's a drop kick to the back of the head again. But he's only kept him down for three. Spinning back kick knocks him down. STO. 2.9 on that tempo. Keep on suplex. You get up days. Brush your legs, sweet. Stomp. 2.9. Striking combination. Picks him up. Into Shiny Wizard. Yep, got the kill off the strong Alright, 35-1. We'll be moving on to the next one in just a second. So the next one is going to be 107 versus 73. Okay. I think his striking would put him over there. 107 versus 18 minutes. Yeah, we should be able to do the the next match after this. And that'll be 30 minutes for this video. Uh, Clinch knees to the body to start off. Rolling wheel kick miss. Rear chin lock. Hard scoop slam right there. Kick to the face. Float over DDT. Two count. Counter dragon screw. Bang. Slap to the face. Another slap to the face. Irish whip. Back elbow. Head butt to the groin. Another flow of a DDT. Hip toss. Uh, 
elbow drop. Snapmare, drop kick to the back of the head. Snapmare, another drop kick to the back of the head. Snap suplex. Dragon screw. Hip toss, elbow drop. Irish whip. Snap mare, stomp to the back. Snap mare, centa flip centon. Execution style. DDT or Imperator style DDT. That time the Dragon Screw did get knocked down. He got a two count off of it. Ten fall. Pulls him to the center of the ring. Single leg crab. Another Dragon Screw. He's the one who needs to be going for leg submissions as many times he hits. The freaking dragon screw. Oh, time. Figure four leg lock. Okay. The silver room. Backslide. Got a two count. Vertical suplex. Forearm shot. Irish whip. Yeah, I was spine buster. Got a two count. And they got the knockdown right afterwards. Four. Three count only. Three minutes left in the first round. Neck breaker. Picks him up. Goes to the top rope. Missile drop kick. I call both of them missile drop kicks. No matter if it's a flying front drop kick off of the top rope or it's the one where they turn in the air. They both consider missile drop kicks to me. Flying front drop kick. Taunting. Top rope body splash. DD2. Release journey sequence. Close one, Larry. Stay away for the pin. Flow over DDT. I wish there was a way to freaking let them still do the count, even if the bell rings and stuff like that. Would, would just won't do it. I guess because I gotta have it set to the MMA style rules or whatever like that. One of those rule sets for her to do it. I don't know. It's what it is, though. Say by the bell. That floor of DDT keep on getting the down stuff. What was that? Was that a headbutt or was that a splash? Because I think a splash would have still got the pin. Either or. Can't really tell. Oh, it should be over. That's a critical. That was a lariat. Yeah, it's over. Sometimes the criticals are instant KO. Sometimes the criticals are what you just saw right there where you still get the 10 count. Either way, it's over if it's a critical. The majority of the time and stuff like that. But the only time it's not over when it's a critical like that is um, if it's not instant KO. Because if the round was going to end, the critical would know. It's still to the next round. So, number 73 one. Happened a couple of times where they get the critical, but because it's the end of the round, what was it? Yeah, 73 1. That's the only thing that don't really matter if that type of crap happens. Yeah. All right, so we're on the last video. Oh, 31 versus 29. Okay. 
Let me make sure I saved it because I don't really know. If I it. So I take 31 then. Of this video, well, I should say the last match of this video, and then we'll do the second half in the next video. This video is going to be just over 30 minutes, probably be under 35. So as we get done, I'm going to do what I have to do, save it and everything. Yeah, so the people who make it to the um, final four, right? We're going to have, what's the name? Um, what are we going to do? Oh, we're going to do tire match rules. So it's going to be infinite amount of rounds, I think. No, for first and third, for first, second, third, and fourth place, somewhere like that. That's what we're going to do, the infinite rounds and stuff like that. That's right. Semis is still going to be the same as, as the rest of the tournament. Yeah, that's right. And the people who determine five through eight, we're gonna have them compete in a um what's the name? A battle royale to determine who came in what uh, fifth, sixth, seven, and eighth and stuff like that to determine those and stuff, you know. Dragon screw, spinning toe drop. Well, it's a spinning toe hole, but it's not the submission one. That was a low drop kick to the back of the leg, I think. Can't quite see it. That was a that was a jumping knee strike. It's raining outside. Iron wrench with some elbow strikes to the arm. Shin breaker. Kick to the back of the knee. Drop toe hole. Scoop slam, stomp. Back body drop. Some kicks to the head followed by a high angle single leg crab. Knee stomp. Belly the back suplex. That was more of a side old suplex, the way he way he went about it. Kick to the body. Camel Insiguri, Camel Clutch, I think that was a Liger Bomb, Brain Buster, he followed up with a stunt. Palm strike. Scoop slam. Two count. Less than four minutes to go in the first round. Elbow to the back. Roll up pin. 2.9. It's some. It's called L's Mar Marcel or something for that. Tombstone Power Driver. I don't know how to pronounce it correctly, so if I thought I'd just say roll up pin, stat power bomb, 
instead of messing up the name if I don't know the name of her moves. I know what it, how it's spelled and everything else, I just don't know how to pronounce it or I forgot how to. Snap power bomb. Get out of the way of that. Belly the back suplex. Oh no. Rope break within the ropes. Drop Toho. <laughs> Reversal. Route ends. That time he took the kick to the body. Snap more. Two count. Snap suplex. Stomp. Snap mare. I ain't know what the heck that flying attack was. Ankle lock with the with the great vine. Okay, backbreaker. Follow that up with a diving moonsault. Climbs to the top. Missile drop kick. Stomps. Ankle lock into the grapevine. Bridging tiger suplex. Another backbreaker. Or is that a rib breaker? It may be a rib breaker that he just did. That was a 2.9 pinfall. Then he got him down for a two count with the knockdown afterwards. No drop kick. Oh no. Roundhouse head kick. Another roundhouse head kick. Two of them in a row. One of them when he was on kneeling on one knee and the next one when he was standing all the way up. What the heck type of submission is that? Most of the kicks to the chest, or I should say, um, shoot kicks to the chest. That's crazy. Because, like, I, sometimes I would think it's a rope break. Like, because if anybody's in the ropes, usually it's a rope break. But, like, um, most wrestling games, especially the older ones, if your body's in the ropes while you're going for a pin, it's not a rope break. But it's only when the opponent's in the ropes. But also, it's not like he's putting his feet on the ropes to like for the pin or whatever. All right? He's the winner. All right. Number 31 won. All right, so, yeah, we're pretty much done with this video. We'll move on to the next one. Yeah, 33 minutes, just under 35 minutes. Like I said. Yeah, like I was saying before with the um thing, because, like, what we did was, like, you know, it's going to be infinite rounds for the battle for our third place and then the battle for to see who's the champion. But before we do all that, right here, you can see that I have... The oh crap, which one to do? I guess I'll do this, I'll do photos. That shit. Oh, never mind. Damn it, what, what the heck is they talking about? What, what was I supposed to do? the heck it was set to before I'm trying to figure out what the heck this shit was set to before
No, it had to be set to the. It had to be set to gallery, so that's what it's always on gallery. Yeah, because then I can look at more than one. Yeah, but like like I was trying to say, like you see right here, you got eighth, seven, six, five, and then you got fourth place, third place, and second place in the champion. Or whatever like that. That's how this stuff went about. Or whatever like that. Because 5th through 8th, they competed in a fatal 4... Well, they competed in a 4-man um, battle royale to determine the winner and stuff like that. I think I had pinfall turned off. I'm not sure. I'm not even sure if I can have pinfall turned off. But I'm pretty sure I did somehow. Anyway... Yeah, that's what we're going to be doing to determine that. So, once we get done with the semifinals, that'll be the first thing we do. And, like, I guess we'll have all four of those videos in one video or like that. So, right now we're doing the round of 16. And this is the first half of that. And then the next video is going to be the second half of the round of 16. And then we'll probably do the round of 8. Plus the semis, because the round of eight is four matches. And then the semis is two matches. And then we can do everything like that. So that's probably how we're going to have this stuff going. So until the next one, hope you enjoy. These were the winners and whatnot. Until the next one, later.